yeah, I'm happy to get it, get it going, man. I mean, now it's like boom, 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 you know? You can never pay that back to everybody. Doping destroys everything and in our sport it destroys the, the trust. The young guys actually have to prove this, the top guys are not clean. So, thank you, Colin. Yeah, it was difficult in the last last couple of days. Um, I was kind of surprised that it's influencing me that much because you know when I started the sport, doping was everywhere in news. I can remember I was in Sardinia and Wolf Aldag and Eric Zabel did the press conference where they were to tears and crying about their doping. Uh, um, confession. So I grew up with that. This one definitely like, touched me a lot more. Now you always uh, ask this question, you know, is the guy in front of you not just a better athlete, but is probably a cheater, you know, and that destroys everything. So doping destroys everything and in our sport it destroys the, the trust. I'm in love with shakes, if they're done right, I mean. So, what do we do? Some ice cubes. I mean, I woke up from a from a nap, and there were just like 15 messages on my phone. Oh, something has happened, and I opened the first one, which was actually from my former former coach Philip Seib, and uh, he was like, "Just fuck, have you read the read the news?" And I'm like, "Yeah, going on the first news, the pro pro try news, and uh, seeing uh, about the Colin Cartier doping case." This is the big story of the day. First place for Colin Chartier. Congratulations on an outstanding race. I've watched this race in Dallas at least for four or five times on the trainer. I was so incredibly happy for, for this guy. Depending on what mood I'm myself, I'm either like super angry or... But then, I mean, like I said, I think um, there's a couple of things everybody needs to, to do is one of them is listen to the How They Train podcast, the episode where they have him uh, in, an, in an interview. And of course, <laughs> that's a problem with a liar, you know, I mean, he lied once. So is he now telling the truth? Is he, is, is he, telling, is he telling parts of the truth? Or is it a whole lie again? It's so difficult to say, but he has to he has to think about all the people he puts now in this situation. Like he said, he believed that the top guys are not clean. Now the next generation definitely have a really good reason to believe that because he did what he did. All the people that surround him, they are now suspicious too. You know, that's that's hundred percent clear and it's very difficult to prove that you're a clean athlete, you know. How do you do that? How do you prove that you're a clean athlete? It's almost impossible. And then also he's putting the bar to a height where you probably don't, you can't jump over that without the help of um, performance enhancing drugs. And therefore, but people still try to jump that bar and get injured or get a depression because they can't. He puts, a, he puts a whole sport in a situation he has been in and it's not enough. Like he can never pay that back to everybody. Like a week ago, I would have said, I'm absolutely stoked to, 
to start the season and for the next races now it's of course with this thing it puts a little bit of a shadow over it but all in all I'm I'm just like yeah I'm happy to get it get it going man I mean now it's like boom 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 you know First two minutes at 400, and then uh, six minutes at um, and then six minutes at uh, 350 ish. Um, yeah, so it's basically the race prep um, uh, session for the next races and since they are since they are coming fast and in in some quantity as well it's one of the last chances to, to build some fitness before we start serious racing so therefore got the dancing shoes out and try push some watts let's go 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 let's go Let's get it poppin', I'm looking away Go tell mother I'm cooking the game Flow like water bubbling up What you want me to make? Taking you back in the day Feeling immaculate, mate Action pack back to back Why you yapping away? I got a knack to react But I'm packing a grace Up to the max with a fact Let me grab the space I had a map to place Who got a laugh and face? Long, long, and strong Looking like a stack full of hate It goes on and on Way to the... I was in a really happy place You know, I was kind of happy for the next generation of athletes It's also difficult Having a, a young athlete, and um, of course he has questions now too. I mean, if you now don't believe that the top guys are clean and that it's possible to win the biggest races in the sport without, you know, doing something that's incredible, dangerous, also to your health and, and everything, how do you find motivation for that? It's very difficult. A little bit tougher than expected. <laughs> Probably like always when you have to go off the cowwebs a little bit, but yeah, nice. It's good to have some company. I still believe, I really believe that still 99% of the field is clean. I think I have to, otherwise it's very difficult. But yeah, then now you, Obviously, it's a, it's a different story than now you think, yeah, it's not just in your, in your own hands. Like some people are preparing different for these races. I think the worst thing is, is silence about it and not speaking out about it. Yeah, it's, it has been, I've been very sad and uh, very angry too. I mean, I, I mean, this is just another, I don't know if it leads to anything, but um, everything put it up, their statement and, uh, and uh, every, uh, everything, but um, ultimately uh, I think I'm, I feel responsible to also act. Um, I think it's not about the young guys to, to do that, but it's about probably people like me and I'll try to, to help and do my best I can.